Welcome back to the next half of our program. <clears throat> Many are familiar with the poem, The Pied Piper of Hamelin, written by the renowned English poet, Robert Browning. The poem was based on the town of Hamelin, which was infested with rats. A piper dressed in multicolored clothing appeared, claiming to be a rat catcher. He promised to free Hamelin of the rats in return for a fee. Ever wondered what would happen if you break a promise? Class 1 and 2 of Bypass Branch will lead us through the town of Hamelin as they enact the Pipe Piper of Hamelin. in 
the theater, living at our best hotels. There must be a couple million and more are coming every day. Soon there could be a couple billion. How do we Rats. They're ruining everything. There must be some way to get rid of them. I know there's got to be a way, and as a good mayor, I should be able to figure it out. But I just don't know what to do. Rats are all that we can think of, the only thing that we The rat 
that's all gone. Yes, I have done my work. Now, I want my reward. But that was easy. Go away. I cannot pay you a reward for this. The Pied Piper is angry. He wants his reward of 50 gold coins. So, he again picks up his pipe and starts playing another strange tune and starts walking down the streets of Hamlet. This time, all the children of the town starts following him. Wow! Wow! Listen to that beautiful music! He is promising to take us to a beautiful land. Let's follow him!
remember, if you ever make a promise, you should never break the promise. Thank you.